December 2006, the Mediterranean Sea, just off the southern coast of France. A nuclear-powered aircraft carrier steams in determined circles as bomber pilots streak on and off the deck, preparing to support American and Allied troops fighting terrorism in Afghanistan. Over the deck flutters a red, white, and blue flag. But it's not the stars and stripes. It's actually the blue, white, and red tricolor of France. Welcome back to our special report under the blue, white, and red. And welcome aboard the nuclear-powered aircraft carrier Charles de Gaulle. This high-tech warship is the flagship of the French Navy and the pride of the French fleet. It's also home to two American exchange officers. I came over here in 1995 on board the Foch before we started the French program to try to see if there were any differences between the way the French operated and the U.S. Navy operated. The bottom line was there was none. From Savannah in 1779 to Paris in 1944 to the Charles de Gaulle in 2006, the friendship between France and the United States has been bought and paid for with blood, both American and French, soldiers and sailors fighting under the blue, white, and red, and under the red, white, and blue.